In this video, we'll decide who can post to your group and what they can post to your group. In order to have this kind of control, we need to install the module Organic Groups Create Permissions, which can be found at drupal.org slash project slash og underscore create underscore perms. Once that's installed, we will simply enable it by checking the box next to og create permissions. And by simply enabling this module, all of a sudden, no one is able to create content in any group. So if we log in as Chelsea, and she adds an article, if she selects group number two and tries to save, she gets an error that says you are not permitted to create article content in group number two. In my opinion, if she can't post anything to group number two, she shouldn't have that group in the audience list at all. If you agree with that, check out the thread at drupal.org slash node slash 1139180, which has some code to add this functionality. Uh, if it gets tested, the module maintainer has already said that he'll include it in the module. So get over there, test it, and let's get this in, into the module. So what we need to do is configure the new permissions provided by organic groups create permissions. So we're going to go to configuration. Organic Groups Global Permissions. And now when we scroll down, we see a whole new set of permissions under Aug Create Permissions. We've got Article Create New Content and Basic Page Create New Content. These are what will let us create either an article or a page within the group. I'm going to give both of these permissions to the Content Creator role. And I'm going to do the same thing for Group 2 and Group 3 since they're overriding the default permissions. Now only members who have the role content creator can post content to the group. Others will receive the error message that we saw when Chelsea tried to create an article.